Each new day will bring a new opportunity to save a life or to make a difference in someone else's life. You will be a hero as you show compassion to someone on the worst day of their life. You will be a role model for young children. Those blue lights will be a welcome sight to a stranded motorist on the side of the road. Please know that you will have a tremendous impact on the public you serve if you remain consistent, principled, and fair. If you do these things, I promise you, yes, you will make a difference. Ever since I got out of the Marine Corps, I've been looking for that sense of responsibility, that sense of belongingness. And when I joined South Carolina Highway Patrol, I found that brotherhood and sisterhood again. The men and women of the South Carolina Highway Patrol are extremely professional, have high integrity, and treat others with the utmost respect. You're the top agency in the state. Everybody's looking at you. So when you show up on scene, and they see the man in gray, they're like, everybody stops and looks. They know you're, you're the man. The structure is more or less like military structure. It's more tailored towards small leadership groups. What's unique about this kind of structure is that it allows us to grow within ourselves. It allows us to make mistakes comfortably, so that way we have support from all aspects of the chain of command. You have to work as a team. You have to be dependable. You have to be independent. And you have to have integrity. You're going to deal with people from all different backgrounds, they all have different stories. So when you deal with them, you have to be able to just dial in immediately and communicate with people effectively. And if you can do that, you will be successful in this career for a very long time. It can get very dangerous working on the side of the road or the side of the highway. So pulling up to that vehicle, turning on those blue lights, forcing cars to move over and slow down makes a huge difference. And people truly appreciate us stopping by and helping them out. It's their time of need and we show up to that call and they appreciate it. 21 weeks of patrol school, that's all you can think about every night is, is when you wear that crisp gray South Carolina High Patrol uniform and driving that fully marked patrol car. Once we got that issued, it was very rewarding to see that hard work paid off at the end. I've got to travel pretty much all over the state of South Carolina performing different duties, whether it be at a University of South Carolina football game, the Darlington NASCAR race, the Myrtle Beach bike weeks. A lot of agencies, they get to do some, you know, activities, but we have statewide activities. Our job is challenging. There are days that are going to be long, but you have so much downtime. In addition to your downtime, uh, you, have, you build a lot of vacation time, holiday time, comp time. I still have that work-home life balance where I can run a successful business on the side. I can still spend time with my family. I can still go on family vacations. I'm truly happy with it. Home's happy, I'm happy, my kid's happy, and my business is successful, so I'm doing pretty good. We had a intoxicated driver with a 12-year-old, and I, my counterpart, was handling the driver, and I was over there with the kid because I've been in that kid's shoes. It's not a fun situation, but the kid was all smiles the whole time. He got to sit in the patrol car, which he liked, so maybe I changed his life a little bit there. I wanted to show that there's a, a different side to law enforcement, a different side to the black community, the African-American community. I wanted to be a positive role model that just because I wear a badge doesn't make me any different than if I didn't wear a badge. I made it on the Highway Patrol for five years, and it's been the best five years of my life. There's no better feeling than putting on this uniform and knowing that you're representing something more than yourself. <laughs>